If you've ever poured ocean water into a glass, you know that it pretty much looks like this. There's definitely water in there. For sure, there's H2O molecules and lots of them. So if you drink it, you'll at least get some hydration, right? Well, here's the problem. It's not so much drinking the water, it's what happens next. The salt water will go into your mouth, then down the esophagus, into the stomach, into the intestines, where it will be absorbed into the bloodstream. So yeah, you do get some water, some H2O molecules will end up in the bloodstream, but it will take with it all of that salt. Now, the body can only tolerate a very specific amount of salt in the blood or sodium if the sodium level in the blood gets too high or too low you can end up with delirium you can even have seizures so how do we maintain normal sodium levels within the blood well it's all thanks to my favorite internal organs the kidneys in fact i love the kidneys so much i actually thought about being a kidney specialist but after residency training, I felt like I was kind of tired and didn't want to go through with it. But anyway, the kidneys will get rid of extra salt by flushing it out in the urine. So all of the blood in your body will get filtered through the kidneys where any extra salt will be added to the urine and flushed out of the body. But here's the problem. You can only make urine that is less salty than salt water. So when you drink salt water, what happens is the kidneys will actually have to draw water away from your body, away from your bloodstream in order to flush out all that extra sodium. So in that way, when you drink ocean water, sure, you're getting some fluid, but the kidneys will compensate for this by actually drawing more fluid away from your body to get rid of that extra salt. And because of that, you will become more dehydrated. And that's counterintuitive, right? Like if you think about being stranded on a desert island, you're surrounded by water all around you in the ocean, but the way you're gonna die is from dehydration. I used to think about this a lot actually, because my mom's side of the family is from Hawaii and uh, right off of Maui, there's this little island called Molokini. It's shaped like a crescent. I don't think there's any water on the island. It's pretty much just like a rock in the middle of the ocean. I used to imagine if I was stranded on a place like that and that would be pretty scary because even as a kid I knew that you can't drink ocean water. Okay that's it for this video. I hope you found it to be informative. If you like medical content like this feel free to hit the subscribe button there or check out another video here and I'll catch you guys next time.